Hey there Capricorn, thank you for joining me. This is your weekly reading for September 28th. This week is all about moving forward, let me tell you. Um, I know that Capricorn for the most part probably feels like they've been run over by a lawnmower, uh, chewed up, spit out, sent into a million different directions, can't figure out where they're supposed to go, all of that stuff. Um, you know, like I say, I have Capricorn in um, four of my major planets. I'm dominated by Capricorn and Earth signs in general, so you know, I totally feel the Capricorn energy. This week, you know, you have a very straightforward week, which happens every once in a while, where a sign has a week that's like just like straightforward, very simple message. Your message is that you are you have the opportunity to be very successful this week. You're gonna have a lot of ideas. Capricorns can be very entrepreneurial, very hardworking, and have a lot of ideas. Even if you have a job or something like that and you've ever thought about starting a business, now would be a good week to start moving forward with that. Um, or if you just want to work, which is fine, there's nothing wrong with that. If you've thought about ways to increase your, your job or your business or um, you know to get a promotion or a raise or something along those lines, or even just to get a job, this week's the week to do it. Ten of Clubs is all about business success, work success, job success. If you don't have a job, getting a job. And it also brings a ton of people in to help you, by the way. Um, you can look at, I, I often say that clubs represent the brain, and you can look at each one of those as one brain representing uh, multiple people coming into your life to help you. This is a great card to get, very positive, represents good things happening to you after a period of great difficulty. So just know that. I think you're going to have a ton of ideas. I think for the most part, Capricorns have a lot of ideas on how to move forward in all areas of their life this week. This card is an idea card. To follow that up, you have the other idea card, the Eight of Clubs, which also represents having a million ideas. This is the most rare card in the deck, almost never shows up for readings, so take advantage of this card. It's a very powerful card. Represents using your intuition this week and in knowing. I think you are going to have a knowing this week, like you know that what you're doing, you're just going to have like this gut sense that what, where you're aiming and the ideas that you have, you're going to be like, okay, this is it. This is the way I need to be going, and you're going to do it, and you're just going to work your butt off, and uh, you're going to be very successful. Capricorn, I mean, you know, Capricorn is a very challenging sign to be. Um, you know, it's funny because I had my whole chart read uh, just a couple weeks ago, and the astrologer was telling me how you know, I have a ton of Capricorn in my chart, and he was saying how in the old days uh, of astrology, they used to think that Capricorn was very negative, actually, and very negative sign to be born under because it's so challenging. But then what they came to realize is that the Capricorns that stepped up and they faced their obstacles became some of the most successful people on Earth in their fields and uh, whatever they had to do, and it's because they have such a hard work ethic. So definitely work this week. Um, I'm sorry that my light just went off. I'm trying to get it to come back on, and it just doesn't want to, but... Um, this card represents that as well, and it represents knowing and um, and knowing how to move forward. It's like I said, this intuitive card. It also represents multiple paths, having multiple paths to move forward on. So just know that there are going to be multiple ways for you to get to where you're going, and that's a good thing because what will happen is when you're thrown an obstacle, because Capricorn has been dominated by obstacles for the past eight years, you're going to be able to just just jump like that to the next path and, and move forward more. And that's what you're going to be doing. And it's going to be like nothing to you. Let me just get this light back on real quick. Um, I have this stupid light set up that's hooked up to my computer that I control with my computer. It's right here. And I had to log in just to get that light to come back on. Five of spades next. Again, another card of multiple hat paths, but it is a card that says don't let the obstacles get you down. I know that Capricorn's probably sighing right now because you're just so beat up with these obstacles. Like I said, run over by a lawnmower and having to focus on so many different obstacles coming at you in all areas of your life. This card just says blow past it, keep working, don't stop because you are on the right path. So if you get one of those obstacles that crops up this week, that's something that has stopped you in the past, just please keep going. Don't stop. You're like, you're like this close to uh, dominating whatever you're trying to get over and get through. So just know to carry that positivity and to just keep blowing through it. This card is very weak as well. So it's like the obstacle can easily be overcome. So just don't get discouraged and keep going because this is your reward right here is the ace of diamonds. Huge, you know, this is big money coming in, making more money, um, more positivity. It is almost strictly a money card. You know, I know a lot of people, they ask me, like, why do I only read for money or why do I only read for love? And it's like, you know, I just read what the cards come up with for the week. I don't, you know, I don't like to lock it in because sometimes love isn't on the table for people during the week and things like that. So, you know, I, li I like to just deliver the message that people need. And this is what you need right now. So 
you know, this is money coming in, better money, better situations, new situations that you haven't experienced in some time. So again, with that five of spades coming up, sometimes when things get better for us um, and something good happens, we're, because we've had such bad things happening to us, we immediately kind of can go a little bit negative and can be like, okay, when's this going to, when's the, you know what, going to hit the fan and when are we going to lose this? Um, but just know that that's not going to happen, and only good things are coming for you. You have an amazing week. Just work, work, and more work, and you will be very successful. So thank you for watching.